Hey, what's up, guys? Cog out back with a video. And today I want to talk about Dragon Ball Sparking Zero and the Xbox version of it. Um, there's a lot of people are saying the Xbox version has been canceled there because it couldn't run on the Series S there. That's the only reason why the Xbox Series version has been canceled there and stuff. Um, people are claiming that there. Saying it's canceled, um, in my opinion, is I have a feeling it is not canceled. So I'm gonna say something about here. Um, Dragon Ball Sparking Zero is not canceled in the Xbox version of the game there because if you go onto the Target website there, Target has leaked Dragon Ball Sparking Zero there, not the not really the cover for for the PS5 and the xbox version of the game or the xbox series version of the game there or series x version of the game they never canceled the uh, hard copy the hard copy there on this game there they never canceled it there um the ps5 this is was kind of interesting there from the the target website there um <clears throat> the uh, rating board onto those things there is a five star rating for Sparking Zero for, uh, <clears throat> there is a five star rating for Sparking Zero for the PS5, but there is no rating for the Xbox yet. <clears throat> um, I don't know what the heck is going on with the Xbox port there, why Microsoft never fixed this glitch there. Um, they confirmed that there, saying it was like a month ago there, where they were trying to fix the glitch there for Sparking Zero. And uh, it's already been a month. It's already it's uh, now it's already been May, and it this glitch started happening starting on the sixth of the uh, <clears throat> I think it was the sixth of April there last month. Technically, it actually happened last month there. Um, we actually had the trailers there for uh, Bandai Namco there actually showed the trailers and it actually showed the Xbox logo onto the system there. So, and Microsoft has not been porting this stuff on their YouTube channel. They don't really port too much Bandai Namco games there. They don't really port too much Japanese games onto their platform there and show a lot of Japanese games on their platform. So, that's the only reason why you don't see too much Dragon Ball there. It's the same stuff with Naruto also, but guess what? Storm Connections came to the Xbox there. Storm connections came to the Xbox there. And guess what? Microsoft never put any of that much of Storm connections on to uh, onto um, the uh, Storm connections onto uh, the Xbox platform. And, but the game did came out for the Xbox there. Um, so <clears throat> um, I don't know when Microsoft's going to fix this there and try to get the... Uh, Sparking Zero back on to the, to the Xbox uh, store there. But like links like Target and Am like Target, Walmart there. All these retail stores still have the game in display. I even I can show you this there guys. Um, I can go actually go to the website and actually show you guys. Sparking Zero is actually going to be confirmed on the Xbox store because <clears throat> um, so I'm going to go to Target here so let's go to Target let's, oh, let's, oh my God. I don't know why sometimes the brightness fuck, uh, screws that up a lot um, but okay Dragon Ball Sparking Zero and uh, if you guys look at right here, let me turn up the brightness just a tad more. This might be a little bit too bright. But if you look at right here, there's the PS5 version and the Xbox Series X version. And this is on the Target's website. So, yeah, they're making the game for, they're making, they're making the game for Xbox there. So if you look at right here, it's, there's the Xbox version of the game. Doesn't actually have the, the, the cover art there because I don't know if they're going to actually put a cover art there. It just shows the Sparking Zero uh, 
uh, emblem there. But yeah, the cover art's right here. So, um, so yeah, there you go on that. It's confirmed they didn't cancel the Xbox version. Like, how, how they be canceling the Xbox version if retail stores still have it on their website there? Like, Target have it on their website there if uh, uh, Microsoft canceled the... Uh, or not Microsoft, but if Bandai canceled the Xbox version there. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if uh, they're going to wait until the game full release is there because we never got the release date yet for Sparking Zero. <clears throat> we never got the release date for Sparking Zero there. So, um, eh. we never got the release date for Sparking Zero there. So, maybe we need to wait until the release date comes out. And maybe the Xbox might just pop it up back up on the storefront there. Um, <clears throat> maybe they need to update the store. Um, because the Xbox update and the store update are totally different from the thing. Maybe we need to wait for a store update from Microsoft there for the Xbox there to actually get Sparking Zero back onto the list there. Maybe they, they didn't update the store yet. Maybe Microsoft didn't update their store yet there. Um, what do you guys think about it? Microsoft didn't may update their store there, but the Xbox version is coming out. Uh, this year why they be waiting it there for a full year if it's already on like websites like target and stuff like actual stores there so yeah that's pretty much it uh comment rate and response to these medals we like our medals please subscribe hit that bell notification i'll see what uploads in my live streams current response to these medals account at your peace